Hey guys, it's Jono. Today I'm going to do a quick video about a game that I just discovered called Two Dots. The audio is kind of bad, so sorry about that. Alright, let's get started. Hey guys, I'm playing Two Dots, and today I wanted to just show you a couple of things that I found in here. Uh, it's all in the tutorial, but I'll show you. I'm not actually doing the tutorial, I'm kind of playing my own way. I like to find out everything in the game on my own, even if there is a tutorial, just so I can figure out the ways that my mind wraps around it the best, and then I can make my own strategies. So you're going to see here, this is a huge box, and uh, this is more advanced strategy, but I wanted to record it today because I happened to do it, and it's not often that you'll be able to do this. So what I did was I sacrificed a lot of my moves so that I could get colors all the way around the edge, and you'll see go all the way around. Now when I connect this, it's going to be a really big deal, so I want to get a bunch of the stuff on the inside. And there they go. That's basically like getting a Tetris in this game. Now I'm probably going to get a high score because of that, so I'm going to go ahead and finish out this game and let you guys see what happens. I'm just looking for a place I can make a square, and there's only one right now, unfortunately. Now this is another situation where I've got a lot of dots. I'm going to clear in an effort to get a box all the way around the edge. Unfortunately, that's not going to happen for me, so now I'm going to go ahead and work with what I got and make the longest string that I can while enclosing the maximum number of dots that I can. Booyah! Let's see if I get a high score. I've been working on this level and I'm pretty much all morning to try and get a high score on it. Negative. I'm trying to be 317 that somebody else in my network has gotten before me. So you'll see here on my map, I'm trying to clear all of the beginning levels with a very high score that would be hard for other people in my network to beat. And if I do that, then I'll feel satisfied and I'll move on to the next level. That's my strategy. This is what I did pretty well on. I beat the scores that are out there so badly that I don't think they'll be able to get to where I got to without some significant work on their part, and I think they may give up before they get that far. So that's kind of like how I play the game. I'm very competitive. I like to get a lead way ahead of everybody else. So that's why I'm actually really liking this Two Dots game because it's got a uh, it's got a leaderboard with all my Facebook friends, and I'm instantly competing with people that don't even know that I'm competing with them. So that's kind of awesome, and uh, I'm pretty stoked about this game. So you're going to see more videos about this game coming from me uh, as I get it more figured out. You can see I'm only on level 4, and I haven't even tried it yet because I'm still trying to get a high score on level 3. Alright you guys, that's my video. Thank you so much for watching, and peace.